So Sadiq Khan, CTAM reported that he's coming out to ch change the names of uh, the London Overground Line, but well, uh, name the Overground Line. So the the idea behind kind of creating or giving identity to tube stations and tube lines and train stations. I don't understand what's happening here, but clearly Sadiq Khan thinks that this is what Londoners want. This is the priority for London. So Sadiq Khan has pledged to give individual names to London overground train lines if he's re-elected as mayor. In his manifesto, he said that the London overground network has grown considerably over the, uh, recent years and that to reflect this, I will launch a program to name individual routes, giving each its own identity. As if we didn't have enough problem with identity, identity politics, we're going to make trains woke. Yeah, let's do that. Because we know what the Labour Party do in these situations. We know what the Labour Party did in Birmingham. The council, Labour Council in Birmingham, when they decided to change and name streets and giving um, street names their own identity, we came up with these ideas. Humanity Close, Equality Road, Destiny Road, Inspire Avenue. Diversity Grove, Respect Way, which that the last one is quite tricky because Respect is also a political party, so uh, or was, uh, so they're kind of accidentally endorsing a different party. But it's an embarrassing situation. Why is it that Sadiq Khan thinks the priority for Londoners is to give identity to train lines and train stations and windows and i don't understand what's going on with london but uh, this is what we are dealing with the same mayor of london who is also introducing his new green deal and which apparently will support 175,000 jobs but god knows how and what that means because we know in the past when the authoritarians whether the socialists or uh, the small c conservative authoritarians have introduced big projects like this using government it's always public sector jobs and it's always fake jobs and non-job jobs. Uh, and they will actually cost normal private um, enterprise jobs. So you're going to destroy the economy and ordinary people's lives just so that you could have some sort of number for your own election pledge. So that when you finish your term as mayor, you say, well, look at me. I created 175,000 jobs, even though hundreds of people by then uh, would have lost their lives on the streets of London because it's not safe. A lot of people lost their jobs and businesses. And uh, again, black cab drivers not supported by the city Khan. But no, the Green New Deal, that's a priority. Well, I hope you enjoyed that short clip. If you want to watch the full version of the show, make sure you click right here. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel and click on the bell next to it so you get notified when I release the daily videos at 5.45pm and 8pm.